After so many years, I finally have the answers and I would like to share it with you guys. Hi and welcome back to another episode of SYWK podcast where you can find everything related to paranormal. First of all, compliments of the season to everyone and wishing you a happy new year in advance. I hope you heard the first part of the series where I narrated a disturbing story from one of my subscribers whose name is Ronnie. He and his dad experienced something unexplained on the 25th of December 2002. If you haven't heard it yet, then please do. The link is in the description. Now coming back to this episode, I will continue with the story and reveal what happened to Ronnie's dad and the history behind the motel. Before we go ahead, I would like to know your feedback. How did you enjoy the first part? Comment below if you're listening to this episode on YouTube or DM me on Instagram if you're listening to this episode on any of the audio platforms. Also, requesting you to please support my work by subscribing to my channel and if you enjoy the series, share this episode with your friends and family. Now, without wasting any time, plug in your headphones and enjoy. The story is submitted by Ronnie and is narrated by a host Tesman. Continuing from where I left, when my dad told the tea stall guy what we experienced, he was aware of such incidents since a lot of travelers experienced the same at that motel. And then he told us what was the history behind the motel. A few years ago, there was a man called Mangesh from a nearby village who had a bar and wanted to construct rooms around that. But due to some reason, the top floor of the motel caught fire and he and a few workers lost their life in that incident. But the ground floor where the bar is located still could function. That's why another person purchased that bar and started running their alcohol services. Many of the customers complain that they can hear people screaming from the top floor, but the owner and the staff assumed that they were drunk and ignored their stories. But it was when one of the staff members had gone on the top floor for some work and had experienced something unnatural. That's when they started connecting dots and were sure that the motel was haunted. To come to a conclusion, the motel was haunted by Mangesh and the others who lost their life. And the shocking part was that the bar closes at 10 p.m. After getting to know this information, my dad could not believe what we experienced. I was still small and did not understand much of the things that had happened. But now, after so many years, it haunts us. It was my dad who reminded me about this incident and now I have so many questions in my mind. Why did the man near the tea stall suggest we go to the motel? Why did the tea stall guy did not stop or warn us about the motel? What had happened to my dad when he left me in the room and went downstairs to the bar? After so many years, I finally have the answers and I would like to share it with you guys. End of narration and back to the host Desmond. Hey guys, to know what happens next, stay tuned. The third and the final part of the series will be uploaded on the 2nd of January 2022. Till then, I wish you a happy new year and stay connected to SYWK podcast by subscribing to my channel. Thank you once again and don't forget to share this episode with your friends and family. Peace out.